Phillips for Hatchin. Oh, it might fall for the Coventry man. It's in. 20 minutes gone. And Coventry take the lead through Keith Houchin, the man whose penalty for York City defeated Arsenal in the fourth round of the FA Cup two seasons ago. Well, Regis battling for space on that far side. It was Downs who finally knocked the ball in, then it fell to Phillips, and finally to Houchin. And with Turner on the floor, Coventry finally forced it into the roof of the net. Now, what can Manchester United do? Because if they lose here, their season is over. The Trafford fans, but what a crucial goal by Keith Hatchin, who did it two seasons ago with a penalty against Arsenal to put them out in the fourth round, and now doing it for Coventry to put Manchester United out, beaten here at home, one goal to nil. Well, having seen Coventry hold Arsenal at Highbury, perhaps we shouldn't have been so shocked by that result. Our congratulations to them. But it took a goal from a cup tie specialist Keith Houchin to clinch it for them. Do you save it up for the cup? <laughs> <laughs> Starting to look like that a little bit, isn't it? Yeah. Well, that must have uh, come out nice today. The difference is that when you got the penalty against Arsenal a couple of years ago, it was the end of the match. Here, Coventry had to hold on for 70 minutes. We had to battle today, yeah. I mean, it was a scrappy. I'm not saying it was the best goal I've ever scored or anything like that, but. Uh, it was a long time to the end. <laughs> you are taking credit for it, are you? Because, I mean, the pitch seemed to play its part as well. I can't remember how many touches he had. It kept coming back off people and I kept stabbing at it. But I've got legs that are six foot long, you see, so I got the last <laughs> touch with it in the end. <laughs> Downs. Phillips for Hatchin. Oh, it might fall for the Coventry man. It's in. What, what about you yourself, though? Because. You've actually been struggling to get into the team, haven't you? Yeah, I've had, I've had a funny old season, if you see. I mean, I had a lot of injuries at the start of the season, and I've started to sort of play a couple of games now, miss a couple of games, play a couple of games. So, you know, hopefully I can start to get a little bit of form together now and, and, and get cracking, you know. <laughs> and are Coventry going to have a cup run? We're it's a long one. time since they have. We're having one. <laughs> <laughs> We've won today, that's the main thing. We're in the hat for next week. Well, a most modest reaction to a goal, that. But if we take a quick look again, I think you'll agree it took some determination by that man. The cross came over. He's, there's a dummy first, which gives him the chance. But it was three challenges. The first one there, he wins well, sticking a foot in. The second one, you'll see, gets a bit of luck. The ball hits his back foot. He gets there first from the keeper. That's good control with the header. And finally, in against Norman Whiteside. Quite an achievement, quite a goal.